Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how to find about the root mean square speed of helium in here. The first thing we draw the diagram in here. We know that before we add about 2400 joules, we know that the initial uh, the first initial velocity that is about 900 now if we add about 2400 joules in here that will be the new one so to answer about this one we need to find about initial temperature in here and then we add about this one you got the new temperature in here so the first thing we have the formula that is about kinetic energy kinetic energy of God. So, in here, that is about this one. So, the first thing we need to find initial temperature in here that is about this one so we put the power number two for the both side so we put m and three r go to the left so we have capital c in here And this is about CI. So this one that is about nine hundred. M we know that this is about 4 grams per mole, but in this one, we need to convert the grams into kilograms. So I will put this number code in here. And all that is about eight four three one four. So we calculate this one, and we have one hundred twenty nine point nine. The unit that is about k. Now after you got this one, we have the second formula in here. That is about this one. So the formula that should be like this. We have Q multiplied by NCV and we have capital T in here or delta capital T and about CV that is about 3 over 2 or multiplied by delta T so we need to find the delta t because delta t that is about the temperature of the final minus the temperature of initial in here so we have n that is about three moles in here or that is about a4314 so q that is about this number in here so we have delta t 
and that is about two q divided by three n r. So we put all the numbers go in here. So q that is about two thousand four hundred. Divide by number three, multiply by three months in here, and all that is about eight point three one four. So we calculate this one, and you got about sixty four k. And now we can find the temperature in the final in here. So T final. So we put this number go to the left, and this one you got about one hundred ninety four. After you got the T final, we can use this formula in here. That is about 1,100 meters per second. And this is the final answer. This is the end. Thank you for watching.